Well, I think there's a certainly a big role for government to play in terms of, um, you know, making uh, the right to, to broadband the same as the right to phone, the right to education, the right to, you know, what, what a fundamental right for, for everyone to be able to, to have access. Um, I think the I think there will be technological uh, support for that. I think you'll see com private companies um, contribute. Uh, I think educators already understand that that that's a critically important thing, and they're here they're here to facilitate that um, that delivery. But you know you, you've seen certainly lots of the, the stories, uh, the frustrating stories from, from teachers in our public school systems who've been you know unable to to maintain full contact with their classes uh, as they moved online just because of the 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 um, the lack of full access to devices and to you know broadband um, uh, and Wi-Fi um, on the part of everyone and that's really that's created all kinds of uh, difficulty for teachers trying to deliver a coherent um, you know coherent uh, learning so um, I think I think it's it's something that we all have to, to um, put a shoulder to I think it's there's nothing that's going to be more important we're going to have some learning loss some substantial potentially learning loss that's occurred particularly for low-income students and um, that's going to have to be addressed in a myriad of ways or otherwise we're going to have this generational setback um, on learning.